Previously on Lunar Lux, the party made it to Silico Colony and found a black market in the mines. They then got a new mini pod from their friend Cypher, giving them access to the world map again. At Oceanus, the Rain Squad ambushed the party, but after a boss fight, they joined the party's cause in order to learn what secrets the Merc Slayer is hiding. Alright, I somehow forgot to show the lucky event location in the previous video. It's all the way in the Memorial Hill area, I think. Yes, right there, in the, uh, high in the sky. Alright, let's continue the story. Dive underwater, yes, please. Lost and fought? Just thinking about the future. There's not much time left. How were the recent tests? The tests failed, but the results were better than prior tests at least. Resonance rate? 90% resonance. Do you think that's enough? Should I? I wouldn't risk it, Soros. We need to make sure it's 100% safe. We'll keep trying. I won't give up on you. Soros. Ah, oh, Thomas, I've been expecting you. Where is Bella? Tell me where she is. Calm down, Thomas. I thought we had a deal. You said you wouldn't hurt Bella. This is outrageous. You've got hundreds of soldiers out there targeting her. Thomas, everything is going according to plan. Bella is strong. She can handle any soldier or vessel I throw at her. Along with the Merc Slayer, they are a force to be reckoned with. I had to do this. Let's just say I had to make this, uh, things appear... convincing. You mean you let them escape on purpose? Rest assured, we will inevitably get what we need. I know you'll do anything to protect your family, Thomas. Please don't hurt Bella. When this mission is successful, we'll drop Bella's criminal charges. I promise no harm will come to her. Actually, since you're here, come with me. I think it's time I show you what I've been working on. You're going to be used as a hostage, aren't you? Lux Ruins? Whoa, where, what is this place? Everything is blue. It's so beautiful here. I discovered these ruins several years ago when I was on the solo expedition. Expedition? This dude's a treasure hunter? Yeah, I was surprised too when he first told us. I thought we already ex excavated all the ruins of the ancients across Luna. Nope, I'm positive there's more relics and ruins still uncovered by humanity. These ruins were once inhabited by an ancient civilization of people, known as the Ancients. They were known for being able to manipulate both Lux and Antimatter, and they thrived during a time before humanity settled on Luna. So Antimatter was being used even before the comet appeared? Thousands of years ago. If they were so highly advanced, where are they now? Could these people be behind the comet somehow? Well, that's what... Uh, uh, archaeologists are still trying to figure out to this day. Come on, let's keep going. What the? Is this a mandatory fight? Luminate engage. Ancient biogenetic cell data detected. What? Oh, nuts. Lux rings abnormal. Awaiting Guardia transmission. Nickel, what the hell is that? Crud. I think we might have to have, might have triggered a security system or something. How come it, it's only happening now? I thought you explored this place before. Guardia transmission received. Commencing the soul trial. Soul trial? Is this testing us? This place might have been a training site for ancient soldiers. I never expected they would be still be operational. The security system never triggered whenever I came here. In any case, let's take it down. Could we have to do with Bella's Lux abilities? Lumi Knight. Of course, every time I pick this, they just give me Voltage Gate, huh? Gun Saber! Bolt Blast! Wow. Moonlight dive. All right. Ooh, that thing was tough. We we didn't set up the security system. More like, who set off the security system? I think our warrior prodigy over here might have some connection to the ancients. Hey, stop calling me that. Maybe descended from them? 
Not you too. Whoa, oh, he catches on quick. Wait, so do you think Bella could be a descendant of the ancients? Hmm, so that means some an ancient would have to enter the family tree at some point, but well, the other part of her family tree would still be from Terra, right? Maybe. Hmm, this could explain my ability to manipulate Lux and the strange feelings I've been having. That means there must have been an ancient still alive somewhere on the moon. If I'm a descendant of the ancients, that means mom also had g ancient genetics. Why would she keep this information a secret? I need to find out more about the ancients. Feel free to examine any statues or ancient texts in the ruins. I learned most of what I know for about the ancients from the relics they left behind. Soldier of Light or Heaven Piercing Lumi Knight. It's not... It's not a merc, is it? It seems to be different from a merc. Maybe. I'm not sure. Yeah, it's not listed in mercs. It's listed as, as misc, even though it does have a similar color scheme. And actually seems to have something to do with antimatter, maybe? Huh. Lux, the manifestation of the soul. Shall a warrior learn to wield it? The power to change the world shall be within reach. Antimatter, the chaotic yet ethereal power of the universe. Shall a warrior learn to wield it? Cosmic eternity shall be within reach. What? Another foe? What? A sword? Great. There's a giant gate blocking the way. There's something engraved on the gate. The four gemstones shall open the way for the soul sensor. So our goal is to find four gemstones to open this door. Looks like we have to complete the soul trial whether we like it or not. That reminds me. The soldier mentioned a name when it spoke. I think it was Guardia. If the soldiers have a leader of some sort within these ruins, I'd like to speak with them. We might be able to learn more about my luck's manipulation. Fair enough. Sorry, I guess I'm just getting a little impatient, that's all. What? Why are you looking at me like that? Nothing. <laughs> Let's go look for the four gemstones. There's a floor pit on this level that leads to deeper, uh, deeper in the ruins. We can look for the gemstones in the lower levels. Just make sure you're ready before we drop down. Because we don't have jet suits. We might not be able to get back up for a while. Looks like some sort of portal. Doesn't seem to be active. I see. Maybe it's a shortcut to return here once I get the gemstones. We like to descend. Yes. Yeah, separate save, of course. What? A, a cutscene already? To the wandering travelers who read our text. Take with you the wisdom and stories of our people. We do not know what the future holds for us, but we hope you can succeed where we have failed. Failed at what? Wait, I don't remember reading this last time I was here. Did the engravings change? That can't be possible. Maybe certain texts appear only when there's someone with ancient genetics present. I wouldn't rule that possibility out. Interesting. That means all the ancient texts humanity has collected and preserved could be holding more information and secrets than we ever realized. This could be the discovery of the century. Let's check the rest of the wall engravings. Dang, adventure runs through this guy's veins or what? It's nice to see him this excited for once. So he's a tough guy on the outside, but a dork on the inside. Hey, what are you two whispering about? Nothing. Yeah, nothing. A hole? Aha, skill. Skill booster. Lunar Vessel, the Q, sleeps. The Queen? What? Is that saying Lunar Lux on it? I'm not sure. Lunar X, Terran Vessel, Oblivion. The rest of the text on this statue is legible. Must be an enemy here. I bet there'll be like three of them at once. <laughs> yup. Knew it. Wow, what is with these odds? Geyser! Crap. Anti down? What? They can t attack my meter? That's insane. Geyser! 
They'll never let me uh, use my strongest abilities, huh? Took that much damage. I'm doing a bad job of dodging this. Problem is that, yeah, there's still effects on the field. Damn, I did such a bad job of dodging, but there's no save point nearby, so I don't fucking feel like redoing it. Ugh. Boomerang, take this! Never underestimate a Lunex warrior. See, I took so yeah, that was pretty bad. And now they give me a save point right after I actually fight the thing. Okay. Upon the completion of the soul trial, a new soul sensor shall awaken. Thou shall carry the wills of the seven champions to bring forth universal balance. Whoa. Whoa, it's an ancient vessel. Yep, our present day vessels and weaponry was derived from technology left behind by the ancients. It's amazing how scientists were able to figure out how to use the tech. You gotta give humanity some credit. Science is our forte. Heh. <laughs> the sacred lux combo of the ancients. Free relic swords and guardia shall appear in battle. Crossing the realms is no longer safe. We must either evolve or perish in an e eternal slumber by a galactic might of our nemesis. Neural Link, Active Skill Cosmic Rift, Our Seven Champions, The Wisdom of Taicho, The Bravery of Silica, The Determination of Copernicus, The Kindness of Lumina, The Justice of Magnesia, The Hubris of Grimaldi, The Trust of Regalia. These names. These are the names of our colonies. The Seven Champions. We know our lunar colonies were named after their founders. It's odd, there's no records of the ancients being alive during the time when our colonies were founded. Maybe it's a lucky coincidence, or maybe they're the ones who founded these colonies by secretly by pretending to be us. I don't know. If we manage to survive Comic Coda, I'll have to look into this someday. It's a statue depicting an ancient adventurer. There is a gemstone embedded on their chest. You touch the gemstone gently, and it starts to vanish. Voice echoes throughout the ruins. Three gemstones remain. The cycle of cosmic calamity is unyielding. Perhaps the unification of Lux and Antimatter is a key. Two forces that unite into a spiral-like power, carrying an unbreakable will to survive and to seize the future. Okay, Ancient Adventurer, a gemstone. Two gemstones remain. The red and white ones have been obtained. Master Energy. If I go through here, is there any f dead end? Oh no, it's a st so many stage hazards. The slab is an illustration depicting Luna and Terra on one side. The other side of the slab has been destroyed. Was our quest for eternity ultimately our downfall? Only time will tell. Is that a shortcut? What? It just took us all the way back here. Is it a one way path? Neural Link. Support skill Ancient Venom. Okay. Okay, Ancient Adventurer, please give. The Yellow Gemstone. One gemstone remains. How do I get past that barrier? Must be from the other side. Neural Link, Active Skill Judgment. Okay, what if we head north? There should be a, a, a one of those gems to the north, right? There are some engravings here to discuss ancient battle techniques using a weapon called the Relic Sword. This sword was able to channel the lex of the user to perform special arts. Red relic swords bestow strength upon the wielder. Blue relic swords augments the lex of the wielder. Yellow relic sword fortifies the defenses of the wielder. Hmm. Oh no, it's gonna have a battle.
just one, okay? Statue depicting an ancient adventurer. There's a gemstone embedded. You touch a gemstone, okay. That's the blue one. You have done well, Soul Sensor. Return to the upper level, I will be waiting. Neural Link. Nightingale. To evolve beyond the standard arts of the Relic Sword, the wielder may combine the gemstones to attain greater power. Orange Relic Sword Secret Art grants the Soul Sensor SP regeneration. Green Relic Sword Secret Art heals the Soul Sensor. Purple Relic Sword Secret Art chance to instantly KO your enemy. Yeah, chance to instantly KO is probably not reliable against bosses, right? Oh, wait. I forgot there was a. I, I, yeah, this was supposed to be one of the pedestals, but uh, for the gemstones, but I forgot there was a candy here. Bell Mint. Yeah. Not that I ever use them. What? Why is there a boss symbol now? You have done well, Soul Sensor. Whoa, this guy's huge. Who are you? I am Guardia. I am an entity programmed to protect these ruins. Guardia, can you tell us more about the ancient people that reside here? What happened to them? Um, unable to process query. Such information is not within my knowledge. You, Bella Gray. Huh? How do you know my name? My processor is able to extract information through your lux. I was able to assess you are not a threat. Okay, we thought we were going to have to fight this guy. However, eep, your lux levels are abnormal. Abnormal? What do you mean? It is higher than any level recorded in my database. Yet it is also in a peculiar state. Your ability to manipulate lux is currently shackled. Your soul sensing is impaired. Guardia, do you know how I can use my ability? Please teach me how to use soul sensing. I have not been operational in centuries. My power reserves are dwindling. I'll be unable to train you effectively. However, it is within my power to awaken your soul sensing. It will then be up to you to hone your abilities. The power of Lux, the physical manifestation of the soul. When awakened, it is not a power that is easy to control. I can do it. I know I can. I'll do whatever it takes to protect the people of Luna. I want to be strong and dependable. Someone that inspires people and instills hope. You have an unbreakable spirit. However, both the mind and the body must be strong. I must assess your strength first. This is the final step of the soul trial. Guardia battle mode engaged. Okay. Bumerang, take this! Tetra Burst! Geyser! Damn, it's so hard to dodge. Stunned, okay. I'm still in it. Gun saber. Okay, time for a Lux combo, huh? Feelingly, they are actually are here. But what would be the best choice right now in terms of damage? Problem is, I don't have much SP. Hmm. 
Brain Squad Deluxe. Anti Saber. Dive. Hmm. Okay, this is actually might actually be enough if I do this and this. Moonlight dive. Excalibur! We did it! Oh, that was close. I missed dodge one of the missiles, so that sucked, but whatever. You have passed the soul trial. I shall unchain the shackles placed on your soul sensing. My power reserves are nearly finished. Farewell, soul sensor. May your luck shine. Forever bright. Are you okay, Bella? Did it work? I feel power swelling inside of me. This is incredible. Those lean Lux abilities have been unlocked. You can now use the de default Lux combo, Lux Overdrive. What? There's a different default combo. What does that mean? It's difficult to fathom everything we just witnessed. That means if I didn't uh, 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 master Lux Force, I would never be able to master it now, huh? Yeah, ancient civilization, soul sensors, Lux. My brain hurts. I wonder if soul sensing is useful in battle. We're gonna have to spar to confirm. Wahaha! Speaking of soul sensing, what are you planning to do with it? Well, I'm hoping I can communicate with the mercs to achieve peace. Wait, seriously? You really don't like fighting those mercs, huh? You guys have always known this. Yeah, but it's kind of hard to set aside the fact that these monsters have killed innocent people, you know? I know that. Bella has the right idea. The mercs aren't just monsters. They are much more than that. Let's head to the final room. Things will make sense once you see for yourself. Never found out how to activate that portal. The seal has been broken. The sword of the ancients is now yours to wield. Active skill relic sword acquired. That's a lot of anti cores. The heck? Are these all the merc slayers? This. Is where I keep all the anti cores I've collected. There's so many of them. Just how many anti cores have you collected over the years? I don't know, hundreds, maybe thousands. And you're, uh, you think you'd be level 99 by now? Didn't Bella tell you about Comet Coda's return? She did. I'm also aware of the Lunex Forces plan to use the Wormhole Machine Celestia to stop the Comet. And despite knowing that humanity is in danger, you refuse to allow us to use these anti cores to power a key to survival. That's why I was thinking too back when we fought in Copernicus. You once mentioned your goal was justice. I still don't understand what you meant by that. Nicole, you've been shouldering a heavy burden, and I know it's taken a toll on you. I want to help you. That's what friends do. We want to help when, uh, help as well. Am I right, ladies? Yep. Indeed. Me too, me too. Nicole, I think it's time you finally tell us the truth. What's really going on here? Let me ask you guys this. What really is an anti-core? Well, anti-cores are a stable source of anti-matter, right? That's only half of it. An anti-core is composed of both antimatter and lux. Its nucleus contains a soul. So then, that gives me an idea. The anti-core is glowing. What the? How did you do that, Bella? Soul sensing. I think I'm starting to understand how to use it. I imagine being able to see the soul inside. To speak with it. Do you hear anything? No, all these anti-cores are silent. But weirdly enough, I'm able to feel the emotions contained within the souls. Pain, suffering, anger, betrayal, sadness, grief. The souls of the mercs inside the anti-cores are trapped. Betrayal? I don't know if this will work, but let me try something. A silhouette? 
No. No, no, this can't be. The soul inside. Looked like... What you saw was the truth. The mercs were once humans. What? But how? Oh no. So the mercs we've been hunting and fighting were humans all along. The mercs are the result of human experimentation. By who? Who's running these experiments? Your so-called legendary hero of Luna, Saros. This, this is insane. These are innocent human lives. Why would he do such a terrible thing? Saros believes that antimatter is the key to humanity's survival. In the eyes of the public, he's the leader of the people, the legendary hero. But underneath that heroic facade, Saros is a mad scientist obsessed with harnessing the power of antimatter. Ever since he discovered the existence of my powers, he's been working on the Merc Serum. A fluid which, when consumed by a human, changes the host's molecular composition. The matter bodies get converted into antimatter. There's still lux in them. The antimatter that he extracted from the years ago uh, from years ago was enough for him to run experiments to try to perfect the formula for the Merc Serum. Every failed test gave birth to a Merc. A human who has lost their humanity, consumed by antimatter. I was never strong enough to defeat Saros, so I was hoping he would eventually run out of antimatter to experiment with. But... He had a perfect system in place. Some mercs he killed on the spot extracted their anti-cores and reused that antimatter for his next batch of tests. Thankfully, a lot of mercs end up escaping through the wor a wormhole once they transform. So in order to get those anti-cores, he simply trained his army to hunt them down. It sickens me. How could Saros do this? Does he not value human lives? He trained us, took care of us. We looked up to him as a mentor, as a leader. Was that all a lie? The missing people post in the BBS, in the ca cafes. They were innocent people captured by Saros, weren't they? Most likely. Saros would secretly capture all kinds of people over the years. First, he experimented with all the prisoners at the military base. When there were no more test subjects, he'd resort to cover-up schemes. The increase in missing or dead citizens and the increase in merc incidents all over Luna were not coincidental. The few soldiers who are ordered to carry out Saros' abduction missions have no choice but to obey, or else they'd become the test subjects as well. Unfortunately, once they complete their mission, they become test subjects anyways. What the hell? That's cruel. It's the only way he can ensure his secret is protected. I still don't understand why he's doing this. There must be a reason. Wherever it is, there's nothing that could justify his actions. Have you told this information to anyone else? You're not the first one I've told. I've had comrades over the years who fought alongside me. We would hunt down escape mercs to prevent Saros from getting to them first. I lost every battle. I lost all my comrades. They were all turned to mercs. The only reason Saros didn't kill me was so that he could capture and study me. So I decided to fight this battle alone. If I allowed myself to grow close to someone, they would be in danger. I distanced myself from the others, so I wouldn't have to experience the pain of losing someone I care about again. I still feel this way sometimes, but I'm going to try my best to be stronger. I hope you can forgive me for the way I treated you all. I'm sorry. Nickel. Stop, you're gonna make me cry. Dude, you've been through a lot. We're the ones who should apologize. We misjudged you. I appreciate your support. I can't do this alone anymore. I need to stop running. I need to face sorrows once and for all. You've been running a solo for all these years, so what's changed? Hope. You guys have given me hope. Hell yeah. We're in this together now. So like, what's our next move? Yeah. What if Saros suddenly busts in and steals all the anti-cores in the next couple of cutscenes? I don't really have a plan. Huh? You drop this tragic revelation on us and expect us to twiddle our thumbs after? Hey, cut me some slack here, will ya? I've spent years hunting down these anti-cores to make sure Saros can't use them. But that's not the only reason I'm keeping them here. These people didn't deserve the fate that was forced onto them. I was hoping I would someday find a way to bring them back. Whoa, is that even possible? Hmm. Maybe my dad can help. Yeah, but he's been captured by Saros. If we got our hands on Saros' Merc Serum, my dad might be able to figure out a way to reverse engineer the formula. What about the anti anti-cores? Would an anti-serum work on something uh, like an anti-core? We won't know until we try. What about Kamakoda? We still have a year before Kamakoda strikes. Our priority right now should be stopping Saros. The longer we wait, the more lives he experiments with. We need to come up with a plan. Let's regroup at the Linux space station. Uh, are you sure it's okay for us to go there? The Linux force is still looking for us. Don't worry, we'll be safe there. Everyone at the space station is like family to me. I grew up there. Are you sure? At least one or two people might uh, be Saros supporters. 
If we're going to successfully take down Saros, we'll need uh, allies. I don't know if bringing more people into this is a good idea. He can't... Um, he can't murk everyone, can he? Every single person... Every single scientist on board. Or always it'd be impossible for him to continue his operations, right? Maintain society and all that. Trust me, Nico, we'll be okay. Okay, I trust you. Alright, next stop, Linux Space Station. That seems dangerous. I'm nervous. And I still don't know what that teleporter does. Xanticore. That's it. The Pillar of Peace is only as strong as its foundation of communication. The ability to connect through the soul will bring forth mutual understanding. So many anti-cores. I have a feeling that Saros knows where to find them now, since uh, uh, since we were flying around here and such. I'm pretty sure he's just going to bust in, grab all these anti-cores, and do sh terrible things with them. Uh, what happened? Were we followed? Did someone follow us? Yup, I knew it. I knew I knew this place would be exposed. What? My ship's here? No way! It's my ship! Surprise! Heh. <laughs> we came across your abandoned ship when we were out searching for you. We figured it would be best to retrieve it and bring it back to you. Oh, you guys, you're the best. Wait, we can actually go to Wasteland? Uh, that seems kind of dangerous. Are you- is it- why- why can't we go to Wasteland before going to- Before going back to the st space station? Wait, let's not go in the military base right now. We don't know who is trustworthy yet. Okay, we should come up with a plan to stop Saros first. Okay, so it's not like they'll let me actually do anything yet. Looks like she has soldiers on duty 24-7 to ensure proper security protocol is met. Be careful not to get too close to our drones or vessels. Why do you have new... That does, why did that count as new dialogue and give me blue hearts? Very strange. I know exactly what you're looking for. Skill boosters! Oh wow, I have to grind a lot of money for that one though. Yep, time to go fight Kronos a million times. There's a new quest in Regolithia. Hey, you're Bella Gray, right? I could really use your help right now, even though she's a fugitive. What happened? I was patrolling Mount Python when a massive merc suddenly attacked me. While attempting to flee, I dropped my gun saber. I mean, I'm glad I made it out of life, but that gun saber I lost was very precious to me. It was a gift from my father. Without it, I can't seem to do my job properly. My colleagues told me to move on and use a new gun saber, but I can't bring myself to do it. I tried, but it just doesn't feel right. Hey, I get it. That gun saber meant a lot to you. We'll help you find it. Oh man, I really appreciate your help. I think I dropped my gun saber at the peak of Mount Python. Were you able to identify the merc that attacked you? No, it wasn't in the database. It looked like a hybrid centaur wearing a vessel armor. Whoa, that's not good. I've never seen anything like it. Thanks for the details. Maybe that merc used to be a vessel pilot. We'll keep an eye out for that merc while we look for your gun saber. Thanks, Miss Bella. I'll be waiting here. Alright, looks like there's another one of these skill booster traders in here. I know exactly what we're looking for. Same dialogue. And about the same price, too. Hmm, I think it's worth it to max out Relic Sword. The Relic Sword is actually very versatile because it can grant Bella a bunch of buffs depending on which colors you pick. And yes, I wrote all the color combinations down so that I know exactly what to use in any situation. Hopefully we won't be arrested upon coming back. Mia, it's Bella. Bella, thank goodness you're all okay, dear. We were so worried about you. Indeed, and I see you've brought a guest. Hello, my name is Nicol. Pleased to finally meet you, Nicol, Mia. You guys are not planning on turning us in, right? Now why would we do that, Mia? We never do that to our crew. We're all practically family here. Speaking of family, Miss Nyla, we're sad. Oh, I believe Dr. Thomas is at the military base. Oh crud, I completely forgot. Well, you're done. When he found out about the mission report for your capture, he stormed out of the lab in a fit of rage to confront Saros. What? No. Dad might be in danger. He's a hostage. I'll try calling him. That might not be a good idea, because now they'll know you're here. He's not picking up. Hold on. What's going on here, Mia? Thomas is in danger? Nicole. Go ahead. You can tell them the truth. 
No, this is terrible. Soros has been deceiving us for years. What he has done is unacceptable, Mia. And that's why we have to go save my dad. Whip Soros. Hold on, Bella. We must remain calm and assess the situation strategically. We can't be sure if Soros intends on harming your father. The Soros you think you know is a fraud. He's a dangerous man. But Dr. Thomas is the lead scientist in charge of working on Celestia. Surely Soros wouldn't get rid of such a valuable asset. I'm not saying we shouldn't be concerned. What we should do is formulate a plan. A mission to rescue your father safely. And to arrest Soros for the crimes he's committed. I will lead the mission. We're going to need allies. Let's gather all the soldiers and scientists in the space station. If they'll uh, join us. Roger that. Will they, any of them believe us? And that's everything. That, the troop of the Mercs. What Soros has been doing behind the scenes. Why he instructed some of you to capture the Merc Slayer and I. My friends, my fellow soldiers. We've called you here today. So we can fight for a common goal. Now knowing the full reality of the situation. We have an opportunity to make things right. Our comrades who were killed by Mercs. The broken families grieving for the loss of their beloved ones. The incidents of missing people all over Luna. So Soros was responsible for all of those tragedies. I understand that this is an extremely messy situation. The people of Luna are not aware of Comet Coda's existence. You guys are doing your best behind the scenes to ensure the people of Luna have a future to look forward to. Now we have the Mercs on top of all this. The Mercs are, are people as well. They were once human. If the public were to find out about the Mercs in Comet Coda, their trust in the Linux Force would crumble. They would lose all hope. We cannot let that happen. We can't let Soros continue to run his experiments. I hope you're willing to fight alongside us. General Gray, we will follow your lead. General? Me? After everything you've told us, Soros is no general of ours. We refuse to follow a man who doesn't respect the lives of the people of Luna. I'm sure the troops at the other departments would feel the same way. General Gray, our trust lies with you. Wow, was that easy to turn them against Soros? Dr. Thomas, the former general, and, every, and even you, Bella. Your family has always inspired us to do better. To have hope for the future of humanity. We'll help you save Dr. Thomas and stop Soros. Simple as that. Everyone. Thank you. Let's kick Soros' ass. Baha. Yeah. Those who can fight, get your gear ready. We'll rip the part for a military base tomorrow. As for our fellow scientists and engineers, we have yet another challenge to overcome. We'll need to figure out a way to reverse engineer the Merc Serum Soros has been working on. Once we can confiscate from him, of course. Overcoming challenges is our middle name. Our battle will be with science. Leave it to us, Miss Nyla. Tomorrow will mark the day where uh, we take the future into our own hands. I vow to protect the people of Luna. To save the innocent people that Soros turned to mercs. To avenge the countless souls that were lost throughout the years. And moving forward, we will find a way to stop Kamakoda. To Gar as a truly united Lunax force. May our luck shine forever bright. Yeah! Bella, that was amazing. You managed to rally all those people together to fight by our side. Yeah, that's some charisma. That was... tough. Oh my goodness. I've never done this speech before in front of so many people. Mom makes it look so easy. You did great, Bella. Mia, yeah, I was pleasantly surprised myself. General Grey, eh? Rolls off the tongue nicely, I'd say. Free thing for our warrior prodigy. Hey! We should get some rest for tomorrow. We've been on the run for so long. Oh, you're right. Come on, girl the girls. We're having a sleepover at the space station tonight. Aha! How does Rain have so much energy all the time? I have no clue. I think it's her way of dealing with stress. Deep down, she's probably nervous about tomorrow. I know I am. Same here. I hope Dad is okay. Alright, good night, everyone. We'll reconvene tomorrow. New Linux Force missions are available. Yeah, it's, it's, we're near the end game, and that's when a lot of side stuff unlocks. So, sleeping there continues the story. Oh, where do I sleep? Hmm, my room, I guess. Huh, but isn't that... So you don't want to sleep in my room? The healing chambers has sleeping pods you can use. No, I mean... I don't really know my way around the space station. I'm probably gonna get lost, so it's better if I stick with you. So I just follow me. Are you sure? Where are you gonna sleep then? On the floor, I guess. I have a cozy carpet. Heh. <laughs> don't worry about it, Nicole. You're my guest. You get the bed. Oh, and Tetra sleeps on the bed too, so... Never mind, I'll sleep on the floor instead. Huh, why'd you change your mind? My hands sometimes slur up when I sleep. I might accidentally melt you. Also, robots sleep. Hey, I got the plant samples you requested. Splendid, thanks for helping me with my research, darling. Here's a reward. 
A lot of bites and gumdrop. Good, I'm gonna need that to buy more skill boosters. Looking for another job? I've got plenty of work, darling. Uh, maybe next time. Ah! Oh ho! Hey! Hey, Cooper! I hope you had a good time with your friends. I did, thank you. It was a wonderful gift. I will cherish it forever. Bella, time is a precious thing. Time is a blessing. Please use the time you have wisely, and spend it with your friends and loved ones before it runs out. And don't be afraid to give yourself a present from time to time. Just let it happen. Here's the elixir and revival fluid you asked for. Wonderful. So do you think you'll be able to create the ultimate healing fluid with these? Actually, it might take a couple of years to come up with the perfected chemical formula. Oh, don't be discouraged. I'll get there one day, I'm sure of it. I'll just have to take things one step at a time. For now, please take this gift. Legend Energy and Holo Fluid. Ah, oh, Skill Booster. I saw the Warrior, which means you're a potential customer. Where are you selling? A Warrior's best friend, Skill Boosters. In order to achieve 100% skill mastery, you'll need to max out the levels of all your active skills. In order to do that, you'll need skill boosters. Let me aid you on your quest to become the ultimate warrior. Okay, skill booster. Nice, nice. Okay, what's in this one? Skill booster again. Good. Even though I'm all out of skill boosters at this location, I've got employees in 9 other locations. Some of them really like to set up shop in places you wouldn't expect. Good luck finding them all. Yeah, good thing th there's a guide for it. Otherwise it'd be impossible for me to find them all easily. Were you here before? N hey Bill, I've got some new tracks for you. Oh, thanks Richie, your music is amazing. Chapter 4 Music So what's your next destination? I'm currently working on a bunch of new compositions with my music crew, inspired by my journeys across Luna. In two days we'll be showcasing our new music at Taicho Cafe. I hope to see you there. I might as well pick up the missions on this board as well, in case they can do them, uh, in case some of them also take place at Mount Python. New plush area order finally arrived. Let me guess. You got me one as well? We both know it's a tradition at this point, heh. <laughs> I absolutely love getting gifts from my, for my friends. Here, you go. Ash the Phoenix plushie. Plush collector, I have them all. Okay, and what about the missions? Two. Pyro worms. A group of pyro worms have been playing coordinated attacks on our soldiers. These mercs appear to be stronger than usual and are highly intelligent. We believe their next target is the military base. What? Your mission is to track down and defeat these pyro worms. Head to Wasteland Zone 1 to speak with Damien for additional details. Leader of the Space Bandits. M05. We tracked down a group of space bandits who may have valuable intel regarding the location of their criminal organization. We have evidence to suggest that this criminal organization is connected to countless unsolved missing persons cases that have been filed over the years. Don't tell me these guys are working for Soros. Oh no. Your mission is to locate and infiltrate this criminal organization and arrest our nefarious leader. Alright, we need to pay a visit to Mount Python. Supposed to be a strong enemy here. As well as the final lucky event. Hmm, this jetpad isn't gaining enough power. Is there a way to fix it? There should be an electrical panel somewhere around here. I could supercharge it and warm up the circuit to fix the jet pad. Brr, let's hurry. Sniff, I'm freezing. Astrotech obtained. Okay, there's a trader, but I don't have enough to buy everything yet, so let's... Wait, why can't I visit the fam realm? It's weird. Do I need a jet suit first? Is that the panel I have to fix? Well, let's have at it. I'm feeling prepared due to my relic sword. Whoa, that's too many. Fuck. This is a bad idea.
bomb them with the cheesecake. Snack time! Never under yes, I just two turn killed an entire group of EX smirks. Ho ho! It's nice to see some fellow adventurers up here in Mount Python. Do you come here often? I come here every day, ho ho ho. It's a long hike from Silica, but it's worth it. Do you know Mount Python is the tallest mountain on Luna? Despite the frigid temperatures, the sun shines the rays here. That's why they call it the peak of eternal light, ho ho ho. Snacks. The Ming machine sells hand warmers and other camping accessories. Astro Tech. Hit point booster. A healing point already. Okay, but what about this? Super Psychic Supercharge. The jetpack should be working properly now, huh? Skill point capsule. Lux Combo Revival Rush. Ancient Mark Kings are erecting to my presence. Let's get in there and see if I can get some treasure. Neural Link. Active skill Nebula Grenade. Revival Fluid. Skill Booster. Okay, there were 150 bites in this barrel right from the start. Gotta remember to check these barrels more often. Alright, gonna just buy the last stuff of these. 4200 no matter the affinity. No, no, it's always using Lux uh, Lunix uh, Space Station affinity. It's gonna be the same no matter where I go. Oh, Soul Saber. Barry's Gun Saber. Eighteen hundred Xenotor. Okay, just go with blue. Take this. Tetra burst. Bolt blast. Oh shoot! They come from it's up there too. Best to stay in the middle to keep my options flexible. Hmm. Of course I get stunned after I pick stun grenade. That always seems to happen. Win. Damage boost. Anti saber. Oops, I screwed up that input. Oh well. Use my best single target and then just go whack him with the Excalibur. Rain Squad Deluxe. All right. That's a lot of bites. I'll definitely help in farming all the skill boosters. Bill, we just saw a shooting star. That was pretty cool. I feel super lucky. Lucky event, the next item or currency you pick up will be multiplied times two. 
Pick up your next item wisely. There's a to- okay. That should be the final lucky event, I think. Yeah. Now to get back and find that shield booster I was withholding. Okay, double shield booster. And now I don't have to worry about doubling anything ever again. What the? There's an EX one here. Oh, shoot. I didn't realize. It must be the mouse EX version. That's gonna be tricky. Those things are tough. And just do the big AoE nuke. No need for strategy. And of course, they're less profitable than just fighting Kronos. You found my gunsaber. You really found it. Yup, and we defeated the merc that attacked you as well. Mount Pine should be safe to patrol again. That's such a relief. Please take this for your troubles, Miss Bella. It's the least I can do. Gum drop. Soldier without their trusty gunsaber is like a pizza without the cheese. Alright, the EX version. The second actual EX boss merc we've fought, huh? Relic sword. Get my meter up. Anti Saber. Hmm. Yellow Blue would be the best one. Yes, I got lucky. Now the ultimate single target one. Rain Squad Deluxe. Oh, lucky again. Now I can finish you off. Hmm. 
Hmm. My SP is running really low, though. I have better pick the SP regen option, huh? Phase mode, and just whack him with the Excalibur. That should be enough to actually finish you. Relic sword. Hmm. Yellow red would be better for me in this situation. Take this. All right. Still about the same amount of bites dropped. But so this could be a good. This is probably the optimal way to grind, huh? Turns out one of the skill booster merchants was hiding in these in the regolithia pipes. Do you have the goods? I've got the goods. All right, the bandits. Are they go? It's probably gonna be a ex version of the previous bandits, right? Hands up! But authority of the Linux Force, you're all under arrest. Hold on, Bella. Let me handle this one. Listen up. I don't know what crimes you've committed, but we're not here for you. We're here for your leader. Nobody here wants to spend their life in a prison cell, so let's make a deal. Nickel, are you crazy? These guys are criminals. I got this. Look, we'll let you guys go if you tell us where your leader is. No strings attached. Captain, what do we do? Hmm, this kid. I can smell a bad egg from a mile away. You're not like Miss Goody Two-Shoes right next to you. You're a criminal as well, aren't you? Bingo. I'm the Merc Slayer. The number one target on the Linux Forces most wanted list. That mask, this guy's the real deal. You're supposed to be in jail. How the hell did you break out? Miss Goody Two-Shoes helped me escape. Hey! So, do we have a deal? No deal. We would never betray our comrades or, or leader. In fact, I've been stalling you this entire time. You fell for our trap, wah ha. What trap? While you were rambling on about your deal, we secretly activated the self-destruct sequence on this ship. Not again. You've experienced this before. Unfortunately, these guys never listen. We're gonna have to fight. I thought resolving things through fighting was my thing. And talking it out was yours. Well, there's missing people out there that are counting on us to find them. The leader is obviously so Soros, right? Either we fight or we miss our opportunity to get the information we need. Tetra, how much time do we have left? We have to defeat them within five turns. That's even less than before. All right, these are just, these space pants are going down. Ah. Uh. Take this. Not good. Tetra first. Geyser. Fine, this boomerang. And Tetra will finish you off. Boomerang, take this! Tetra first! Alright! And self destruct sequence deactivated. Crud, you guys are insanely strong. You should have accepted my deal when you had the chance. Even though we lost, we're keeping our mouths shut. In that case, Tetra, scan the ship for any clues that might help us. Scanning. Hey, this guy has something in his pocket. Mine key? What? This mine key is used to open the laser gates in Silica Mines. That must be where their hideout is. We've got to head to Silica Mines ASAP. Let's zip. Treasure capsule? 5,000 bytes, 50 skill points. 50 Astrotex, Elixir, okay. 824913. Skill Booster. Okay, what's this one? Soul Saver? 
Red, that's not good. What? Tetra Scanner Vitals! They're dead! Their wounds are, were too severe! Who could have done this? The traces of antimatter on their battle suits, the large bite wounds, and the thermal energy readings tell me we're probably dealing with a merc that can manipulate fire. Like a moleculoid. No, something even bigger. Let's keep our guard up in case a merc shows up. What? That was unexpected. I thought we'd be facing a really big bandit dude. This is turning to a horror story. But I know where that key leads. It has to be in the black market. None of these people seem to care about all the corpses here. The heck? So weird. Use my key to open the door. Everyone, we came to get you out of here. It's the next horse. Oh, thank the heavens. I thought we were going to be trapped in here forever. Why is everyone knocked out? Please follow Tetra and she'll escort you to safety. Wait, the leader of those bandits. He's still out there. If he finds out we escaped, our lives would be at risk. He'll just hunt us down again. Don't worry, after we get you out of here, we'll arrest the leader of the bandits. And we'll search for the rampaging work that dwells within these mines as well. You'll be safe under our protection. Oh, you don't understand. The leader of the bandits. He is, he is the rampaging work. What? Don't tell me he used the Merc Serum. Perhaps I can explain. Greetings, I am the Kerberos, leader of the Space Bandits. Took you long enough to find my hideout. Kerberos, why are you kidnapping people? These people are innocent, they haven't done anything wrong. It's all part of the job. Yeah, Saros' job. At least it was. Explain. For years, my bandits and I have been secretly working with General Saros, abducting and kidnapping people for his experiments. Is anyone recording this? We could use this guy's testimony to nail Saros. So you know the truth about the Mercs. I've known for a long time. Us bandits, we don't care about what's right or what's wrong. Then why do you kill your villain people? All we want is money and power. Saros gave us money and promised us power. In exchange, we did all of his dirty work. Today, Saros paid me a visit. He said he no longer needed my services. And he turned me into this. Look at me. I am a monster. You're a monster because you killed your own men. Funny thing is, I don't even remember doing it. When I became a merc, everything was a blur. My mind was consumed with overwhelming pain and rage. It's taking every ounce of my strength just to speak with you. The fact that Kerberos has the ability to speak. It means that Saros' Merc Serum is close to being perfected. You! You need to fix this. I'm sorry, we don't have an Anti-Serum yet. Right now, we're unable to turn you back into a human. No, 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 I won't accept this. If this is something that can't be fixed, there's only one thing left for me to do. I will kill the man who turned me into this monster. And I'll kill anyone and everyone who tries to get in my way. Bella, Kerberos' anti levels are spiking. He's about to go on another rampage. Alright then, team, let's take him down. There's gonna be an EX version of him in here, isn't it? Oh man, this guy looks really strong. Yeah, he, he, his normal version is already on par with Xanotaur's EX version. That's insane. Yes, that's what I needed. Take this! Bolt Blast! Okay. Damn, I didn't get the good draws. Rain Squad Deluxe. Bolt Blast! Yes, I got lucky. This might end without the enemy taking a turn. Okay. 
Excalibur! Relic Sword! Take this! Excalibur! Nice! He drops just, uh, just as much bites as uh, uh, Xenotaur. I expect to fight an actual boss here. Soros, he's been working with criminals like Kerberos this entire time. Hey, let's not focus on Soros right now. We just stopped the criminal organization that was responsible for not only the missing persons reports, but hundreds of other unsolved criminal cases as well. Now we can focus on saving the innocent victims that have been turned to mercs. We're one step closer to justice. You know what? You're absolutely right. Great job, team. Mission complete. Also, there's leftover treasure. Skill booster. Seriously, do you really have to leave everyone's bodies out there? Why? Why? Uh, uh, how come the rest of the black market isn't panicking? Holo fluid. Hyper energy. Treasure capsule. Secret key obtained. Wait, what? 2,000 bytes. 75 bytes. So much treasure here. Skill booster. Damn, I knew he had an EX version. Three thousand. That's insane. Stunned for now? Oh boy. Relic sword. Double blue. Eventually, he's gonna get his turn. Relic sword. Take this. Bolt blast. Did I seriously just skip all of his turns? Damn. Maybe I should go play the lottery, huh? Rain Squad Deluxe. Still the same number of bites, so it's actually more efficient to fight Xenotaur because Xenotaur has the same money drops anyway. We're here to help with the Pyroworm mission. What's the current situation? The Pyroworms have started their next coordinated attack. 
Our soldiers are currently fighting them in Wasteland Zone 2. Alright, we'll head there right away to provide backup. Seriously, it's kind of strange to be able to do all this while being fugitives. There they are. An EX version as well. Backup has arrived. Let's take over from here. Alright, I'm gonna try to use my soul sensing. Please listen to me. There is no need to be hostile. You can understand us. I can. My soul sensing allows me to communicate with you. Our family. Saurus has turned them, uh, us all into mercs. He must pay for what he did. For our pain and suffering. We do not trust you. The Lunax Force was supposed to protect the people of Luna. All of you have failed us. They're not listening. Saurus must have given them a more refined version of his Merc Serum, just like with the Bandit Leader. Their anti matter is heightening their feelings of fear and rage. We have to rest, re restrain them before somebody gets hurt. Alright, let's gear up for battle. Ugh, they're, every individual one is so tanky. I actually stunned all three in one turn. That's so insane. Anyways... Nuke them with cake. Warrior. I'm sorry we had to do this. We'll keep your anti core safe, and I promise I'll find a way to reunite your family again someday. Let's go, Bella. We have to report back to Damien. I see. I can't believe Soros would betray us like this. Some of my friends went missing a couple of weeks ago. Soros must have turned them into mercs as well. I hope we can figure out a way to revert the mercs back to, into humans someday. Until then, I would be happy to help you and your team in any way I can. Thanks, we're glad to have you in, on our side. Actually, there is something you can do. Gather as many soldiers as you can tell them the truth about Saros. We gotta get more people for s army. From now on, any anti cores you obtain must be preserved and kept safe. Roger that, I'll do my best. Before I forget, please take this. Support skill Dragon's Call. And that's... It for the mission. Was that enough to max my affinity? Yes, it was. Okay, that should make it... A, that should lower the prices for all of those skill boosters, since they're all tied to the Lunex Force for some reason. There's one in the first bandit ship. Do you have the goods? Got the goods. Yes, number 3600. That's much cheaper. Alright, so there was one here. Spot a warrior, which means you're a potential customer. Why, why are you giving me that dialogue? I already know what you're selling. There we go. Oh boy, Guardi the Guardia has an EX version too. What? No, wait, that's not Guardia. That's just a bunch of regular dudes. Psycho Zoe is not an EX though. That's weird. Hmm. 
time. Excalibur. All right. There we go. I didn't see the boss yet. Maybe it must be further up ahead, maybe? Oh, no, it's here! What the heck? It's in the... in this room. Oh, boy. Lumi Knights as well. I hate those. I hate Lumi Knights. Take this. Take Has so much help. Geyser. Anti down, no. Nuke. Oh, nuts! <sighs> oh, good, finally. Voltage gate and... Crimson Aura. Not die. Not easily. There. Hmm. Rain Squad Deluxe. Yes, the stun worked. Now I just need to finish you off. Nighting Gale, I still have enough for. Relic Sword. 
Lux Ferdy. Take this! Never underestimate Aha. the Lunex Warrior. Still only has the same amount of bites as Xenotar. Seriously. If they're gonna you're gonna make them like several times as tanky as Xenotaur, you're you need to up their drops. It's only natural. Okay, we're in Silica Rifts near the cave that we end up stranded in. More skill boosters. Okay, there's one Copernicus. I spy the warrior. Thanks for tuning in to this Let's Play of Lunar Lux. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, and or hit the bell icon.